what's up guys D rich here and uh, as you see me pick up the first blood there it should be pretty clear that I'm playing Modern Warfare 3 what else am I going to uh, post right now you know I think it's what uh, what most people want to see and if you don't I'm sorry feel free to um, go ahead and click the back button and look in the rest of your sub box and find something else to watch you won't hurt my feelings so anyway I gotta say there, there's a lot of stuff I can say about this game uh, first of all as hard as it is for me to admit this um, I think they did a pretty a pretty damn good job with this game it, it, it's a lot of fun I'm kinda like cracking out on it a little bit I got my gold UMP so um, that was just like one of those things I, I set a goal on right off the bat and I've gotten that now so <clears throat> excuse me I've got some allergy stuff going on again man it's like that time of year or something but uh, anyway I've got my gold UMP so I may move on and start you know back into playing some Battlefield 3 I'm um, gonna be completely honest I do still prefer that game to this game but as like you know uh, what am I looking for as pessimistic as I was uh, about this and I didn't do that right there that little head twitch it's like a theater mode glitch or whatever so if you're seeing that in other people's videos it, it there that's not something you just do in modern warfare 3 is the is do the dougie real quick right there i don't know what's up with it but um like i was saying i was so pessimistic and i was like man they're gonna screw this up and there's gonna be all this stuff that's gonna be so whack and and and, and make the game not fun and it's just not the case uh it, it's extremely fun there is one thing i will say there are so many routes and so many little flanking um flanking paths and so if that you're gonna get killed a lot from behind when you first get this game but I've had a couple people mention that they were thinking about getting it for Christmas and uh, I don't know if that was like necessarily an inquiry as to what do I think could I recommend that uh, I will say this if you're looking for something for like uh, team play longevity um, and something like a totally new experience get Battlefield don't get this and if you have bad internet get battlefield don't get this um, that way you can play on dedicated servers um, although in all fairness you do sometimes still get killed around corners and you do light people light people up sometimes and they turn on you and kill you it still happens in battlefield i mean it's just internet that's just playing online it's playing in any other format other than lan or split screen that's gonna happen um but uh, you know if if, if you love Call of Duty already, um, you know, or you're even fond of it, or just want something really fast paced, a lot of excitement and noise and chaos and fireworks and, um, you know, guns and lights and all the crazy, uh, this is the game for you. It's, I, I can't not recommend it. And I really wanted to. <laughs> and teabagging you, friend. But your friend got me. Uh, and if you put your full name with your middle initial on Xbox Live, you are a scrub. You're a noob, more than likely. I'm just saying. I hope none of you guys have that. Actually, I don't care. Um, but, you know, it's uh, early this morning, and uh, I put a video out opening day of this game. It was kind of a, I don't want to call it a failed live commentary, but I forgot to turn the game chat volume down so that you could hear the other people in my party. And, um... It is it, the audio wasn't uh, wasn't quite right. Uh, I'm on a Mac and I'm just I'm kind of still working through some of the um, the variables on on getting those things set up. But, but I had a lot of fun in this game. I don't necessarily care for this map. B is I, it's odd. They put the domination flags in like weird places on this game. Um, and I guess they were trying to like go the opposite of Black Ops, where like B was basically a death trap on pretty much every map. It's not necessary that's not necessarily the case but B is it's not it's not really in the middle a lot of the flag points are triangulated domination's got a different feel uh, you know it just it it feels different it's not this get get the right flag the middle flag and spawn kill everybody from the left flag or get the left flag middle flag and vice versa um, but it, it just feels different it feels like there's more a little more running around um, that you do and a little less action unless you know exactly which path to take it it's a lot about knowing these maps a lot of people complain about them I don't think they're as bad as people are letting on but I think 
like it as a community in general we're so conditioned to to really fuss about Call of Duty and complain about it like people are looking for something to complain about and the maps are all they have so they're just letting the maps have it and uh, I don't think they're nearly as bad as people say I think more really the problem is the spawns are really bad the spawns are atrocious in this game especially in free-for-all which have historically not been good spawns but this is the worst of those um, you know and I, I'm not really fussing about that it's it's constant action if you want to go in and work on your reflexes and work on your gun skills there you go it's your opportunity you know show and prove big boy and I'll see what you can do um, but as far as domination goes team deathmatch but specifically domination if the other team holds two flags on me I feel like there's not a good spawn for me and I think it may have something to do with the positions of those flags like where they're at where they're kind of where they're kind of triangulated um, they're not in a straight line or a staggered line uh, as you can see here like C's kind of to the right and behind me, A's kind of to the right, or to the left and behind me, and then B was like straight in front, it's like a triangle. Uh, so it's weird, I mean the power the power position of this map is the center of the map, and that's the case in, in most of them, uh, as opposed to maybe a long line of side, or strong, you know, or heavy left to right, it's, it's kind of like the middle, and the problem is, to me it seems like you spawn mid-map. Um, I don't remember that in one of the other Call of Duties. That may have been the case. Um, but if you spawn mid-map, the thing is, if you're playing against reasonable players and people that are just playing like I do and running around like a madman, people are, people are going to be coming up behind you as soon as you spawn. And, uh, you know, vis-a-vis, -vis, you're going to spawn right behind other people. Like, a guy could have just came around the corner and you spawn in and you plug him. Like maybe he just killed you, you respawn looking at his back. It, it always seems to happen to me uh, as far as getting, you know, being the one getting shot. Uh, it seems like I get killed by the person I just kill a lot more often than I get that to happen. But you know, it's all about perspective. Life's all about perspectives. I mean, we all, felt like second chance people killed us the most you know it's, it's just the way it's just human nature we, we feel like the bad stuff always happens to us the most but uh, more often than not that is not the case guys and you are not old enough or mature enough to uh, have discovered that about life and uh, let me be the one to tell you uh, stuff gets better things are tough at times and you have to uh, persevere and bear through some uh, bull crap occasionally but uh, man, bad stuff is just not going to continue to happen to you if, if it is right now. That won't always be the case. Hang in there. Uh, so anyway, all right, enough of that. Uh, life lessons and, and uh, motivational positiveness. Back to Call of Duty. I, I, I'm loving this, um, honestly. But like I say, I still prefer Battlefield, and I think I will for the longevity of it. I, I, I don't feel like this game is going to be able to hold this level of interest for me for probably not much longer than um, maybe a month. I, I mean, I can already tell that I'm kind of like, mm, you know, um, about playing it. I, I, I'm not as excited as I was the first couple of days. Um, but that's because I also haven't had a squad to play with. And um, this is one of those uh, CODs that is, I think, much better to play with friends, especially if you're struggling. And that helps cover your ass when you respawn so you don't get spawn killed quite so much I think hopefully they'll patch the spawns guys keep your fingers crossed I tell you what if Infinity Ward starts patching this game make sure to pick it up if they're gonna support it so other than that man uh, you know let me know your thoughts on it I mean if you played it uh, I'd be interested to hear from you guys and, and let me know I'm thinking about doing the absolute perfect support class video thumbs up if you want to see that dirty south stand up <laughs>